doctor's name just in case give me a break mom it's dr arlander and you've got the number of the hospital and the area mom code. lewiston's only 19 miles it's not in the moon for pete's sake i'll call you and let you know how bad your brother is how bad can he be he broke his ankle sliding to third that don't make him a basket case it doesn't make him not don't <sighs> you'll be all right I told you I'll be okay. If Grandma wakes up and calls for her tea... Mom, what do you think? I'm not gonna make it for her. Come on, I'll be all right. Georgie, you're not still scared to stay alone with Grandma, are you? The way you used to be? Mom, I'm not six anymore. I'm 11 now. I'm cool. Tell Buddy I'm sorry he broke himself up. You'll be all right. I wish I was any place but here.
tea. If Grandma wakes up and calls for a tea. Mom, what do you think? I'm not going to make it for her. She's totally blind in the hypertension, and God only knows how her heart can keep up with all that you weight. You know how to deal with her best, Ruth. You know how to shut her up. Oh, how I treasure you, my dearest loving brothers and sister. You're turning me into a sharecropper in my own life. She's more dangerous now that she's senile. What makes you think she's senile? Just because none of the neighbors' houses haven't burned to the ground? Just because their dogs Shh, haven't come home lately with pieces up, of Jim. human meat in their mouths? Oh, just God, because no babies have been born without fingers? Is that what makes you think the trail of evil has stopped? Hello, Grandma. Oh, God. What if she dies on me while Mom's up to the hospital? She won't. Yeah. But what if she does? Okay, I'm gonna count to ten, and if she doesn't move, it'll mean she won't die while I'm watching her. God, don't let her wake up until mom comes home and we'll never say the F word again. Amen. Wait a minute. The tea went through the floor. Uh-uh. No way. I go back in there. Forget it. I'm not going back in there. Uh-uh. Yeah, but now wait a minute. Catch hold of this. What if that's some kind of secret place grandma's got in there full of secret stuff? I don't care if it's full of all the neatest stuff I ever wanted in the whole world. Forget it, I'm not going back in there. She might wake up. She's our mother. Medea was someone's mother. Messalina, Lucretia Borgia, Typhoid Mary, mothers, every one of you them. You want me to scream? Is that what you want? Ruth, God help us, we're looking out for ourselves. You're our sister, but if you don't contain this thing, please, Ruth, please. God, get away. Shut up, the boys will hear. Well, she had babies, and they didn't die. That's for sure. Otherwise, Mom and Uncle Jim and Aunt Sue wouldn't have been born. on fire. Books. 
the ones they won't talk about. Oh, wow. Now I find out what all the whispering's been about. <sighs> Necronomicon, the incanabula of the mad Arab Abdul. Al has read. What's this stuff mean? The return of the great old ones? Hoster and Yagsothoth. Frightful sleeper in the deep. Cthul Hugh. Cthulhu. What a dumb name for something. I can't read this stuff. It must be in some super secret ancient language. Arab or French or like that. Oh, Grandma wrote all this, like a diary. So that's how she was able to have babies after they kept dying. And they threw her out of the church. Wow, Grandma's a witch. That's dumb. No, it ain't. Certainly is. There's no such thing as witches. I offer my light to Thulu, he who drinks from the chalice of night. but I have some more. Grandma? I never heard Grandma make a sound like that before. She said stuff from the book. Now I'm gonna get it. Mom's really gonna kill me. She died while I was watching her, but he's really gonna get on my case. So, well... Maybe she's just having one of her bad spells. Yeah, sure, like the night all the graves in the cemetery blew up. Grandma? Maybe you're just sleeping, huh? Maybe you're just sleeping. What that was? I'll tell you what that was. That was an authentic death type rattle, and Grandma's gone, dead, out of it. Mom's gonna kill me. Uh-uh. No way I touch her. Pulse or no pulse. Yuck. Nothing. Oh, boy. Uh, well, Dr. Arlander, I took her pulse, and it, it was my conclusion, you see, uh, that she was uh, deceased. Uh, grandma, that is. Oh, boy. Wait a minute. The detectives always hold a mirror up to the corpse's face. No way I'm getting that close. Don't be a wuss. What am I supposed to see? They never tell you in the movies. Breath, yeah, right. It would get foggy like a window in the winter. Last chance, Grandma. Stop fooling around, okay? Wake up or mom will chew me out for letting you die. I better do it again. Maybe I didn't let it sit long enough. Maybe if I do everything right, I won't catch it. You're gonna catch it, chump. There's no which way about it. You're in deep, you know what? Screwed up again.
again like it did two weeks ago with the storm. Damn hell, Miss Dodd, you got the biggest mountain in the whole world in Mars, too. Oh, boy. I'm gonna get killed for sure. Oh, boy. I wish I'd never found this stuff. It's all Buddy's fault. Why do you have to break his leg? Look at her face. It's a sacrilege. Cover her face. Heck no. Uh-uh. I'm done going in there. I touched her once already, didn't I? Listen, Dr. Arlander. I made her tea. I took her pulse. I even did the thing with the mirror. So what if I didn't cover her face? I don't want to do this. Boy, I'm telling you, I did not want to do this. I don't want to do this. Oh boy, I don't want to do this. Georgie, there were trees down. It's freezing in here. Georgie? Something wrong? Mm -hmm. Grandma died. I didn't know what to do. I was awful scared. Now Grandma's with us. Oh, 